Oh, got a little something on there, I see. It just stuck out through the water there, you guys. Oh, <gasps> yes. Whoa. Dude, is this a sign? I think it is. Gosh, what did I just find, you guys? Oh my gosh! What does it say? Inside. What is going on today, everyone? We're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing here. I haven't been to this spot since last year, you guys. This spot is insane. It is full of a cool variety of stuff, you guys. The fisher is on the other side of this bridge. That's where we're gonna be starting here for today. I got on this side because the wind's a little bit calmer. But let's get everything laid out today and see how that luck plays out, you guys. I'm super excited. Let's go. All right, we're on tide. Ready to get our first throw in today with our Brute Boss 360 degree magnet. Met the Fisher out here. Don't forget to check out those channel links in the description, you guys. Absolutely beautiful day right now, you guys. See what happens today. A lot of snags going on in there. I gotta be careful throwing from shore. All right, first throw, I got me a two by four, dude. Look at that one. Holy smokes, there's a whole bunch of nails and stuff ran through there. I gotta be careful with that one later on. This thing could be used as a freaking weapon, dude. Holy smokes. There's like a door hinge or something bolted or nailed to it. Not sure what's going on there. Let's keep throwing. Oh, what in the world is that? It's a, dude, it's a sink drain thing. What? It's like the, the the catcher for like a garbage disposal on a sink. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, after we unmangle it there. All right, we're off to a interesting start for today. Two throws, two very wild finds. What's got there? A window weight? Uh, nice, a number man. fiver. Nice. <laughs> Definitely could be five pounds. Does it feel five pounds? Uh, no. Not really? Dude, look at this one. Oh, is this a lighter? What is, is it? It looks like a hole punch kind of. Oh yeah. Except it's not very pokey. Is it like a knife sharpener? Like, oh, it whoosh, should be. Whoosh. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably what Check it is. Check that out, dude. The fish fillet knife sharpener. Three throws, three very different finds here. Nice. Wild, dude. This spot could be pretty cool. Oh, look it. You know what? What's that? This is probably the drain for the sink that they were cleaning the fish <laughs> and sharpening <laughs> right. their knives. Right. Yeah. And then he just started stabbing the heck out of it. <laughs> And then he threw it in the water. Ooh. There's a sunken ship out there, dude. Check it out, you guys. Alex got his magnet snagged here. Probably on that wooden thing. You can see it from here. Right. We got Alex's magnet back. Well, hold on. Drop it on there, yeah. Hold on. Oh, it's not magnetic. No? Is that just a massive thing of driftwood? Oh, what the heck is that? Oh, it's a shot back. No kidding, <laughs> right, for sure. Oh, God, look, it's still got the cord on there and everything. Wow, guys. man. Yep, look it, right on the handle, the old shot back. <laughs> That's crazy. Look it, holy cow, how old do you think that thing is? We can turn it on. You guys, we would have never found this with the magnet. At least I don't think so. I just tried to stick the magnet to it and it wouldn't because it's pretty much all plastic. Was it just that piece in there? You didn't have yeah, the pocket? Yeah, I think I didn't see the rest Weird, of it. Weird, man. I wonder why. What is that? Is that a frog in there? What the heck? Where? Frog or like a fish? Oh, there is a flipping frog in there, dude. It's got like, <laughs> oh what is that though? I don't know. Hold on. <laughs> what is that? You guys, hold on. Let me get some sunlight here. Look it, you can kind of see. What is it looks that? like a frog or something. There's a leg sticking out of this thing. <laughs> Come here. I can't get him out. That's a frog, dude. Do is they live really? underwater? Or is it a crab? No, it's a it's a frog. I can see it. That is 100% a frog. At least I think so. It's some kind of creature, dude. It's got what legs. In the world. Look it. Is it stuck in there? Yeah, he's like stuck. I can't get him out. Come on, frog guy. <laughs> The shot back frog. He he climbed in there and he gained too much weight. I can't get Maybe out. he did. Maybe that's what happened. Uh, come here. Oh, you got him. Got him. Nice. Dude, no way. Little there was a frog. little frog in there. Now me and Alex were just talking. Do you think this frog like crawled in there when it was a tadpole or like a little baby? And then it grew up in there and it got stuck and couldn't get out? He's still 100 percent alive, man. Heck yeah, he's excited. It's free. Look at he's like, holy cow! I can see the light! Unbelievable! I've never caught a frog before. What the heck do we call a frog? <laughs> frog? Uh, hey! Oh, railroad yep. spike a railroad spike on there. Some cash money. Heck yeah, you guys. Anything else? 
It's kind of a weird looking. I think that's wood. What in the world? There might be a little nail or something going through there. Yeah, looks like we got uh, spike roo on there, you guys. We're always good for a few of these every time we come out. The wood with the nail could be part of like the actual river house that was here. Sure. You yeah, no know. kidding. There's so many nails, it seems like they just dump the whole Didn't when we fished here that one time from the boat, there used to be a few houses yeah, here, that's right? What I'm saying. Yeah. I was, even until recently there was right on. Right okay. I forgot well, about no that. Pretty here. cool. Oh, we got a piece of wood. Let's get that out of the water there. Thing's been down there for a few years. Look at how warped that is, my goodness. Oh, did I land on something, dude? What in the world? Yeah, we're pulling something in here, you guys. Seems very, very long. What in the world? Is that just a big old rod, dude? What the heck? Check this out, dude. You think this is the old like water pipe or something? Uh, did those old boat houses have water supply going to it? What in the world is this? Gonna add this to our scrap pile for today. It's starting to pile up pretty well here along the shoreline. Not bad at all. Oh, got a little something on there, I see. It just stuck out through the water there, you guys. Oh, <gasps> yes. Come on, Ice. Come on, Ice. There we go. There we go. What is that, a speaker? Or a hubcap? Or a steer wheel. Or, yeah, right. It looks like a speaker. Yeah. I think it is a speaker, actually, you guys. Yep, yep. Yep. Check it out. There's the electrical wire. Dude, this is a big old boomer. Big old 15 inch subwoofer, man. Back from the 80s. Boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm talking about, man? Heck yeah. <laughs> there was one other spiker long looking thing on there, you guys. Sure enough. I think this is what stuck out through the water there, like a shark fin. Check it out. The infamous railroad spikeroo, number two of the day. Or two or three, I think. I can't remember. Pretty cool. I got something on here. It looks just like, I don't know, a bunch of mangled up garbage. Good to get out of the water, very least, you guys. Some cable wiring there. Could be just some, uh, obviously something mechanical at one point. Yeah, maybe a few lids, like paint lids, and just a bunch of stuff that uh, does not belong in water. <sighs> oh, whoa. Picked something up out of the muck there, you guys. There's some more scrap. Nothing too, too unique at all there, man. Nothing there, a couple lids, a few bottle caps, you guys. Nothing crazy. Snag, dude. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Snag, dude. Oh, I might have pulled something off of whatever I was caught on, though. I like the feeling of that consistent weight on there. Oh, absolutely. Dude, look at that. What in the world? Is that a sign? It's an electrical cord on there. Oh, that was the cord that you caught before. This piece was so big, it wrapped everything up on it dude maybe like the side or like the frame piece of the old boat houses that used to be here i wonder if i look at my old videos i can see the what the boats used to look like back then because i forgot you guys oh double a battery on there you guys the old king wolf on there oh, oh. look at this one bro this kind of looks like a trot line weight this is the biggest paperweight i've ever seen look at that that's kind of cool looking interesting man probably weighs like two three pounds some solid iron here some good cash money Cha ching Oh, what the heck is that? There's like some sort of strap there. What the heck? That felt like some old caution tape or something back from Halloween day. Talk about some garbage to get out of the water. Holy smokes. Oh boy. I'm stuck on a freaking tree rut. A tree rut? Whoa. Dude, is this a sign? I think it is. Oh my gosh, what did I just find, you guys? Oh my gosh, it's what does it say? Sides and Altoids. Altoids. Holy smokes, dude. dude. That's cool. Man. That is very freaking cool. Oh my cool. gosh, that's so cool. It was like right behind what you were hooked up right. on. Right. Did I get the magnet? Is it even magnetic? 
I don't, see. I, don't, I don't think it would be. No, it's That's literally not. crazy. So it's wood oh then, right? Oh my gosh. That's insane, bro. Dude, it's not in terrible shape. I mean, you can still put so that in your garage. Cool. Look at it. Uh, that is very, very cool. It's got like cool. a plastic backing on it or something, uh, you guys. I gotta be super careful with this thing. I don't wanna crack it or break it. We definitely gotta get this one cleaned up. Unbelievable, That's you guys. Cool. It caught me the old Altoid. Al Altoid, I think Al I pronounced it. What yeah. is it? Altoid. Altoid? Altoid. I know what I said. Alt oh, Altoid. Altoid. Yeah. Altoid. Oh. Whatever. Yeah. Depends on which what country you're say? from. Chewing, chewing gum. <laughs> really? I thought they just made mints. I, I didn't know they made gum. Not a low calorie food. <laughs> no sort of ear or anything on there? Huh? I bet you that's from the 70s. I, I was hoping for like a year, oh, like a yeah, established know. date on there you know, or something. That'd be super cool. Absolutely. Amazing find. Wow. Oh, what in the world? We got a 90 degree angle there, man. This came right from someone's workshop there. Maybe that's what it is, a right angle, like kind of something that you would draw along or trace. Or it's like a piece of a frame or something there, you guys. Who knows? All right, guys, we moved about 100 yards down on the left side of the bridge here. And we can see that the old poles or like the support beams for the boathouses used to come down all the way through here. I'm willing to bet that it went all the way down to this bridge, you guys. So we're going to find out if this entire shoreline is loaded full of cool stuff, you guys. Let's get our magnet back in the water and find out. Oh, what the heck is that, dude? Look at that. It's like a freaking uh, big rock threaded through a, like a spike of some sort there. It looks like a sparkler. That's the most interesting find I might have ever seen there. It uses like a hammer of some sort, like a barbarian hammer, man. Check that out. Freaking interesting. Hey, look at that, man. That's a really nice lure. I haven't found much fishing tackle today, you guys, but this makes up for not finding much. This just needs a few new treble hooks. The old ones are pretty rusty, but I really like the color on that one, you guys. I bet you off the shelf, this thing costed like six, seven dollars, man. Not a bad find at all. Oh, what in the world is that one? That's a strange one. Looks like a big old freaking gate lock or something, you guys. Maybe, maybe not. I uh, have no idea, honestly. This weighs a couple pounds. It's just gonna end up on our scrap pile for today, you guys. And eventually at the scrap yard for some cash money. I have no clue what this is. All right, guys, about 20 throws or so on that side of the tree. We only came up with a few things. So on the right side of the tree, much closer to the existing boat houses, we're gonna give it a few throws. Let's go. Hey, more fish and tackle, but holy cow, you guys, that one. I don't think we're gonna be able to reuse that. The rubber on this thing has just deteriorated, dude. It looks like someone was chewing on this thing for 10 years. Holy smoke. Too bad, you guys. I know there's some much better fishing tackle in here. Let's keep throwing that magnet. Ooh, there's something pretty darn heavy on there. Look at that, man. What the world? Looks like a really old mine cart wheel or something, you guys. Check that out. It almost looks hollow like there's something in there. There's like a little, uh, it almost looks like a electrode or something where you would connect wires to it there. I have no idea. Maybe if I got some extra time, we'll throw this on the bench and scrape all of that rust off there. See if we can find any remaining word stamping or label on there, you guys. This one is really weird. Pretty darn heavy, too. that dude it's like the old drain that they replaced that one with holy smokes i don't know if we're gonna be able to get that out of the water you guys oh dude oh we caught an entire freaking drain you guys check this out wow The strength on these magnets is absolutely incredible, you guys. I bet you this weighs like 30 pounds or so. All just rusted, cast iron, man. I doubt either of those drains are being used for anything anymore, you guys. But that one is significantly older than whatever is sticking out of the water now, you guys. What an incredible find. You just never know what these magnets are gonna catch on next, man. What a crazy throw. 
Check that out. Right beside it there, I saw some cable wiring attached to whatever it is there, but it's just sheared off. I'm not gonna worry about that anymore. Let's just keep throwing the magnet, you guys. Oh, there's a bag. Is there anything in the bag? Maybe, dude, what the heck? Oh yeah, there's something in there. Almost feels like a knife or something. Uh, maybe not there you guys it kind of just it's just a piece of sharp scrap that looks like it got poked and uh penetrated inside of there this freaking thing stinks man what a great item to get out of the water guys holy smokes that's that is trash Ooh. we got a little something going on down there oh something darn heavy what the heck is that? What in the freaking world, dude? That thing is fully metal right there. I, I couldn't tell you a single guess of what the heck this used to be here. Looks like a couple of rocks, honestly, like rusted on there or something, man. Holy smokes, that is good cash money scrap weight. Big metal Lego brick, it looks like. There we go, next throw. Dude, is that another one of those freaking things? What the heck is going on down there? First of all, you guys, we got a slice of Swiss cheese. Check that out, man. The old scrap Swiss cheese, anyone? My favorite kind of cheese. And another one of these big, heavy coagulations of rock or something, man. Pretty cool. I'm going to take them home just to see how much iron this really is. Let's keep throwing, man. We got a little bit of time left. That's something. Some good weight at the end of the magnet here, you guys. Or a whole bunch of small somethings equaling to a big old mess there. A few door hinges, at least I think that's what that one would be. Got all the nails from the hardware store. That looks interesting though, you guys. That kind of looks electrical. I have no idea what that is there. Maybe it's some sort of like fuel pump or something. Who knows? Let me know what you think down below in the comments. Maybe it's even like a, a fishing rod reel or something. What in the world? Looks like, uh, dude, some more Swiss cheese, man. It's honestly, it looks like the top, the very, very tip top of like a 55 gallon drum. And I'm sure this place is filthy with them. I think they use drums to float like, almost like a pontoon for the old boat houses, you guys. At least that's what I remember them looking like last year. Again, I'm gonna have to take a look at my footage. Hopefully I can catch some of these old houses here and show you what they look like right now. An endless amount of nails, of course, you guys. Let's keep on throwing here. Got a few more left in me. Oh, look at that. Dude, there's a little caster wheel on there, man. Maybe for like um, like a little rolly stool for in the old garage. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe like an office chair, you guys. Who knows? Pretty cool though. Hopefully I can find whatever the heck uh, this was attached to out there. A few things hanging out on there. I don't think it's anything too special, you guys. Just a whole bunch of scrap weight. We keep finding chunks of this cable wire on there, you guys. Is that like power line or something like that? Who knows? Or maybe it was the tie down for some of these rafts on the boat houses. Another little chunk of it right here. That stuff is everywhere, man. Holy smokes. Look at that. Wow, man, that is a lot of scrap -a -roo. I thought I saw a little bit of color in there, you guys. Got a little bit of fish and tackle. But unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna be reusing this one, you guys. That thing is deteriorated all the heck there. Yep, whole bunch of Swiss cheese scrap on there. Some soup lids. Nothing too crazy. Oh, there we go, dude. Is that a, one of those old school roller pins? Look at that, bro. It's like a conveyor belt roller. That's insanely cool. It's another first of the year, you guys. Last year, we found a good dozen of these things and we were calling these things washboard rollers, but realistically, it could be anything. Who the heck knows, man? Super cool history right here. I think the washboard rollers, last year, they had these gear pieces on the side. This one, it doesn't look like it's missing the gear piece, so this could be something different. Super cool, you guys. You can roll us out some pizza dough, man. Check it. Wow, 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 wow. 